and his bow. I live in Amsterdam. Um, I have something to show you, um, which might be of help whenever you do P-ponics, Akaponics, whatever ponics basically. I want to have slow feed into your system. So I'm going to show you my system first. It's very small. Uh, first I want to, to do um, aquaponics, but then I thought, well, fish. I'm not that much into fish, you know. So I started with this, and it didn't cycle totally, but it's getting there. So I feed grow beds, very small. They're a bit deep, because first I thought that I needed, I wanted some tomatoes and other stuff, really big plants. They all drain. That's number two. And there goes number three. Joins. I'll do some down there. As you can see, there is a bit of a problem. Not iron deficiency, no other deficiencies. I think just the alkaline. And then, of course, the hydroton, they clog my drains. So I put a little net down there. And as you can see, the tissue is here. Where because it was getting too much algae into my system. So in here is the sump and I put a little stocking for my girlfriend over the pump because I didn't want all the, the shit getting into the pump. And then today, last week actually, I ordered these. And this one as well. And that is to drip my fertilizer, well, I might in this case pee, into the system. This is now water, but now it's just set up. And they work like this. And it's, you see this little thing here. If I close it, and I would open the line, so to make a drip, let's see how the little wheel up. And then it starts dripping. It would make a vacuum, but because it's open, you see air can come in. As soon as I close it, the air stops. And it will create a vacuum, and then at a moment it will stop. That's why I use this plastic bag. I thought I <laughs> it wouldn't be these things wouldn't be there. So of course this is for the time being just a setup. So now I'm going to show you how you can make this very easily with no hassle at all.